Give me back the good old days. Hey, what do you hear? What do you say? My Facebook, YouTube, Twitter, Instagram, Google Plus, your sister's ass, the Pony Express, a very ticked off Vic here. You know what ticks me off? Cable companies. Yeah, it's that simple. Cable fucking companies. They don't tell me you don't know what I mean. Have you ever seen a service that is more fucked up and a, and a provider that is more fucking unbelievable than a fucking cable company? Follow me. Let, let's be serious. Almost every day, one of these three things happens in my house. I have to reset the modem because the phones are dead. I have no cable or some cable or the audio is there and then not there or the picture gets all fucked for a second or the Wi-Fi is weak or the Wi-Fi is gone every single fucking day. This is called the triple play, the triple play package in cable land. Oh, what a deal. Phone, computer, cable, everything wrapped up in a neat little package like a piece of shit in a box with a pretty bow. Usually, the triple play is a good thing. It's an amazing thing to see in baseball. The triple play is kind of rare. In hockey, I guess you would call it the hat trick. That's where a player gets three individual goals in one game. But in the real world, the triple play is not exciting. It is not rare. And quite honestly, the triple play makes me want to rip the head off every cable executive and take a crap down their dirty fucking necks. In what industry is this kind of spotty or no service remotely acceptable? If this was a restaurant, halfway through the meal, the waiter would come and apologize for the interruption and take your meal away, just like they do with cable. And maybe they bring it back, but with less food on the plate, like less movie to watch, but they still charge you for the full meal. How is that acceptable? If this was the water company, every day you'd have a shower interruption where the water stopped flowing. Or it was only hot, or it was only cold, or it only came out of one half of the shower head. Or maybe it just dribbled out of the fucking shower head. Like slow Wi-Fi, I'm so sick and tired of wondering, hey, the phone hasn't rung all day, I wonder why. And then finding out it needs to be reset again. Or I'm trying to send a video and the Wi-Fi is out or so fucking slow I can run to the person's house to show him the video and beat the fucking email. Or you're watching a movie and it's a critical point in the picture and audio freeze. Then comes back after the moment you waited all movie for. It's like making love for an hour and then having the orgasm while you sleep. What the fuck is the point of that? I know, I know, some of you are thinking, oh, you don't need cable. Go get Roku or Shmoku or Hulu or Shmulu or Fubu or Smoobu or Kukukaju or, or the Amazon Rainforest or Sling, whatever the fuck that is. I don't want those things. I just want regular cable. That, that's all I want. I just want to get high, make a drink, and put on the fucking Yankee game. I don't want to fucking start the launch sequence to send the rover to fucking Mars. And when I pick up my phone, I just want it to work. And when I go online, I just want to be able to connect without having to plug and unplug and, and set and reset or do anything. The old days were simple. Pick up the phone, dial the number. That's right, kids. Dial the fucking rotary phone. And it worked every single time. If you wanted to turn on the TV, you, you pulled the on-off knob out and used pliers to turn the channels. And if, if there was a problem, you went on the fucking roof to play with the antenna. You go, is that okay? Is this, yeah, that, no, a little more. And fuck the Wi-Fi. We didn't have Wi-Fi back then. There was no computer or internet or, or any of this shit that has completely fucked our society. You read a book. And if you wanted to Google, you picked up the encyclopedia. That was Google. Give me back the good old days. Or if this is the new world, the way it's going to be, then just make the technology work consistently and properly. Cable companies, that's what ticks me off. <laughs>